Hey there, today I have a short story to unbox. So if you're not familiar with Short Star, it's another one of those online styling services very similar to Stitch Fix, except for Short Starry, they're geared more for petite women. So since I'm only 5'1", <laughs> I definitely petite, this is very good service for me. Okay, so I've done Short Starry probably about maybe a couple years now, although I haven't ordered a box for a while. I think it's been about a year. I think this is my sixth box with Short Starry. But overall, you know, I think I've been pretty happy with the service. They do have a $25 styling fee, which you pay up front, but is applied to anything you purchase. They don't have one of those discounts, like a buy all five, like Stitch Fix. But I think the prices as a whole, in my experience, have been pretty good. But anyway, here's my what my box looks like inside. And you have a packet of information and a return mailer to send anything you don't want back. Okay. And here's a look at my bundle. Hmm. Actually, the colors look kind of fallish, yeah? I don't know. Okay, so um, with Short Starry, they provide you with a little information on all of the items. And it looks like I got six items in this box, so that's, that's pretty good. And I have a note from my stylist, and my stylist is Caitlin. So what I'll do is I will scan this and put it up above so you guys can read it in case you want to, but I'm gonna go ahead and read. Okay, so I think it, it does sound kind of promising, but we'll see. I, I, I see the pictures of what I've got and I think it'll be interesting. Okay, so the first item in my box is this top. Wow, hmm, check this out, look at the back. Very interesting. Hmm. Okay, here it's a very um, cool tone periwinkle blue color, I think. And let's see. So this is the Naomi twist back top, and it is a size medium petite, and it's by the brand Muse Petite. Oh, and this one is forty-four dollars. Wow. So forty-four dollars for this top. It's <laughs> Hmm, I don't know about this back, honestly. I'll be honest. It's cute though. It it is um, kind of a just a twisty back. It's a soft um, jersey material. It's very soft, and yeah, it's definitely different. Not something I would have chosen for myself for sure. I'm not sure how you deal with this back, cause <laughs> but very very interesting. <laughs> Maybe a little young for me, but we'll see. Okay. Next. Oh, this is just a very basic, kind of different, but basic. Does that make sense? Top, it's just a t-shirt and it's got two different kinds of stripes. So it's just, yeah, this isn't the print, it's two different fabrics. So that's interesting. Huh. This is by Petite Principal. And this is a brand that I've only seen from Short Story, so I don't know if it's an exclusive brand. And this is the Petite Principle Tyler Mixed Stripe T in charcoal, size medium petite, and it's $32.65. So yeah, $32.65 for this t-shirt. Hmm, seems kind of like high, but it's very nice. It's soft. It's more of a elevated, I would say, than just a standard t-shirt. So, okay, interesting. Okay, next. Hmm. Oh, this is nice. It's a Daniel Rain top. I notice everything is kind of cool tone, so I wonder if I'm cool. I'm not sure. <laughs> I haven't figured that out yet. Okay, and this is the Petite Ruffle Blouse in the color blue, size medium petite, and it's $54. So yeah, $54 for a Daniel Rain top. I think that's about what they go for, but I do really like this. I think this is a very pretty print. This is, this should be pretty easy to wear. I don't think you need to wear a camisole underneath, which would be nice. And you'll see it has some interest pleating and buttons in the front and this ruffle sleeve. And in the note, she said she this is good for like a Zoom meeting or something. <laughs> so yeah, you can just pop this on. Zoom meeting, YouTube video. <laughs> I like it. Okay, next. Hmm. Okay, yeah. Oops. All right, I have this. 
jumpsuit. Yeah, I, I own zero jumpsuits. I've tried a bunch of jumpsuits from different styling services, but I've honestly never found one that worked for me. And this is by Gilly, and Gilly's a brand that I really love. Size medium. And this is the Layla Floral Jumpsuit in the color blue, pink, ditzy floral. Size medium, $68. So, ooh, 68, so it's definitely the most expensive item in my box, but wow, it's really cute. I mean, I don't know how I'd wear this though. I guess I'd have to wear something under it. It does have pockets and it's just a nice, comfortable jersey material. Yeah, I wonder if you could just wear like a t-shirt under this. I don't know. Okay, we'll, we'll have to see. <laughs> oh, okay, and next, I have another dress. Oh, this is very nice. It's kind of a rust color or I don't know what color this is. Yeah, interesting. Okay, this is the Petite Ava Faux Wrap Dress by Petite Principal again. And it's in the color Terracotta Print, Medium Petite, and it's $68. So yeah, I think this is very nice. I don't know about this color. So we'll see, I like the style of this dress. It's something I think you could definitely go into fall with, right? Because isn't that more of a fall color? And it does have like three-fourths length sleeves. But yeah, we'll see. I, I, I like it. We'll see how it looks on me. <laughs> okay, next. Okay, I got a pair of shorts. Hmm. These look tiny. <laughs> Don't they? Okay, and these are the three-inch mid-rise butter short. 1822 denim in the color indigo, size 28, but it says it fits like a 29 and it's $46. Yeah, they do look tiny. Okay. And they're just basically a very basic looking short. They're just a dark wash. It says it's butter, butter denim. It's super stretchy. So yeah, you know how I just bought a bunch of shorts though from TJ Maxx. But um, yeah, okay. So let's see how these look. Hmm. Okay, so not, not a bad box. It looks very promising. So now I'm gonna go ahead and I'll try everything on and we'll see how it looks. Okay, so here is that first top with the very interesting back. <laughs> and I have to say, this is a lot better than I expected. I was just thinking when I first pulled this out, this was an absolute no way. <laughs> but it's kind of actually fun. It's not as bad. I mean, there is a little bit of, you know, in the back, but it's something that just not, not a work top, but maybe kind of a fun going out top if I ever go out. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, I can picture this if I ever get a chance to go to say to Vegas or something and go see a show or something. Yeah, or something like that. But, oh, hi, Kitty. Um, yeah, I think this is really a cute top and it looks nice, I think, with white jeans. And one thing I notice about um, Short Star, they do take into consideration proportions. So that's why I think I notice a lot of the tops I get are just cut off here. So they're like almost a, a crop, but not quite. It's a little longer than a crop top. Um, but just because, yeah, proportionately, if you saw my video <laughs> about the golden mean ratio, and I'll put a link up above, um, I think they do know about that. <laughs> Okay, let's try to put a jacket on. And here it is with a denim jacket. This is that boxy denim jacket that I got from Gap Outlet. And yeah, I, I don't know how it looks because I can't see, but um, yeah, not bad. I do think this is uh, a possibility. <laughs> okay, so here is the Daniel Wayne top. And you know, I really do like this top. It's very um, light, it's pretty, and there's kitty down here. Watch out, cat. <laughs> yeah, so you'll see, I do like this print, and I think it looks nice with white jeans. I bet you could also wear it with just any kind of denim jeans. Oops. But yeah, I like this one. I think this one may be a keeper, and let's top it off with some kind of jacket. That's what I have. And here it is with a denim jacket and this is just a cut from the cloth medium wash um, yeah I think that looks cute and this is this I think is a keeper I'm really liking this shirt 
Okay, so here are the t-shirt with the different stripes and the butter shorts. So yeah, the shorts, they're a little short, but boy are they comfortable. The, the butter denim is just so stretchy and I think it's nice actually. It's just a very dark, very basic. It doesn't have real pockets in the front, but it does have pockets in the back. I think these are pretty easy to wear. I don't know if they're too short for me, but I kind of like them. <laughs> so we'll see. And I just have the t-shirt front tucked here into the shorts, which was their suggestion. And you can take a look at this shirt. It's very interesting, actually. Here, here is what it looks untucked. But yeah, it's just a very nice kind of, I like the drape on this. It feels good t-shirt but I don't know though if I like this kind of like half half it kind of reminds me of the Joker or something like that yeah the Joker or the Riddler one of those <laughs> okay so here is the dress and yeah I think this is a very pretty dress it looks definitely like work appropriate it's a little on the low side so I'd probably have to put something here like a cami <laughs> I don't know. I have so many dresses that are this faux wrap, and I always have to wear a cami under. I probably should go look for one of those things, you know, like you just, it's a fake cami or something. I don't know what you call it. But okay, yeah, so um, I don't know, guys. What do you think? I think it is very pretty. The color surprisingly looks, um, I don't hate it, and it would be a nice addition for fall, I think. And the length is just right. I mean, it's not too short, not too long. It just hits in the right place, I really do think. Hmm, so yeah, this is definitely another possibility. Hmm. Okay, and last but not least, I have the jumpsuit. <laughs> yeah. Wow, and you know what? I don't hate this. I think it's a little big on top, but I just put a tank top. And I think that actually looks Okay, it kind of reminds me of Phoebe from Friends, the look. <laughs> yeah, but um, yeah, the, to me, this length is nice. I don't have a jumpsuit, and it's a pretty print. It's this easy knit material. You don't have to mess with any zippers or buttons, so it's easy to put on. I don't know how it is to go to the bathroom, but... <laughs> I kind of like it. It feels comfortable. Hmm, I have to think about this because, yeah, I think it's cute. I mean, let's let's see how it looks with a denim jacket. Okay, so here it is with a denim jacket, and this is a white denim jacket this time. Yeah, okay, so I think that looks cute. I think this is a nice, I don't know, going out to brunch or whatever. You could probably pull this off at the office, I think. Yeah. I think it has some possibilities. But yeah, it's very nice. Better than I thought. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> I, actually I was pretty surprised and impressed with the items this time. You know, like initially when I first pulled them out of the box, I was like, hmm, I don't know. There wasn't a lot that I saw that I really liked just from seeing it without trying it on. Like I knew the Daniel Rain top I, I like because I've had a lot of Daniel Rain tops in the past, you know, but I was pleasantly surprised and I think it just shows that you really have to try things on. So let me know what you guys thought of the box. Not sure what I'll be keeping. I actually do have some credit, so I'm, I'm very fortunate that some of you guys have signed up using my referral link, so thank you very much. And if you are interested, I'll put my referral link if in case anyone does want to try it. But anyway, <laughs> thoughts overall. I do really like I think this Daniel Rain top, and uh, I think this is one that I'll be keeping for sure. I like that you can just wear it. it you don't have to mess with a camisole, I think, with this one. Sometimes these tops come with a, a built-in cami because they're sheer, but this one looks like you, it's a standalone top, and it fit nicely. It's a throw and go. I like that. Also, I'm thinking about this dress. Um, I'm gonna have to look at the try-on 
film, you know, that's what I normally do because sometimes I'm like, oh, it looks so nice or, oh, I don't think it looks nice. And then when I look at the actual try-on footage, it's like, wow, that actually does look nice. So let me know what you think about this color on me. Hmm. Yeah, I am, I am researching colors right now. I'm going to be hopefully having another style tips video because I think that's really important and I've never, I've never figured it out and I'm 55 years old. <laughs> Okay, also, I really like this jumpsuit. I'm surprised because when, when I saw there was a jumpsuit, I'm like, ugh, that's going to go back. But when I tried it on, it was really cute, I thought, and comfortable and, you know, it's easy to wear. I love this kind of knit material. It's just really comfortable. That's all. Did I say comfortable enough times? Yeah, I probably did. But yeah, I, I do like this. So I'm considering keeping this too. Let me know what you guys think. And... This one, <laughs> I, I, I don't know if I'll be keeping it, but I'm glad that I tried it on. I was pleasantly surprised. It was like, I felt like a little bit like J-Lo, you know, honestly. <laughs> Maybe not exactly but for me, J-Lo. Um, yeah, I think it was kind of glamorous, you know. <laughs> I'm just not very glamorous myself. But, but yeah, I, I kind of liked it, but uh, I don't know. It might be too much for me. But we'll see. This top. Yeah, it is cute. I think it's a nice quality t-shirt and it would be very easy to wear. It's such a nice soft buttery material. But um, yeah, I don't know. I think this one was, what was this? $32.65, which is the least expensive item in the box. These shorts are very cute and super stretchy and comfortable. I thought they were gonna be too tiny for me, but they did, they fit nicely. The only thing is I do have a lot of shorts right now, so I'm not sure if I'll be keeping these. And they were a little on the short side. Okay, so let me know what you guys thought of the clothes. I thought it was a, a good box. Uh, there were a lot of items that surprised me, and I'm not going to be keeping everything, but I'm definitely going to be keeping maybe two to three items. Possibly four, but most likely two to three, I think. Yeah? Okay, so that's all I have for today's video. And now I'm gonna get one of my two furry companions to help me say goodbye. And the only one here, again, is, is Kaya. And she opened her eyes when I said companions. I don't know why. Kaya, you gonna help me say goodbye? Kaya? Okay. I think she will. She looks sleepy. Come here, baby. Okay, and here is Miss Kaya. Kaya, say hi. <laughs> And, oh boy, yeah, she is definitely my most loyal companion, I think, because she's always with me. Very, very faithful, that's all I can say. And if you don't have a dog and you want to get a dog, I would get a dog like this. <laughs> but highly recommend. But anyway, thanks again for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. I do a lot of shopping hauls and unboxing videos and I do have a thread up box that just came with some dresses. I got like six dresses from thread up. So I'm kind of excited to open it. I'm debating if I should just open it today. Today's actually a work day. So I, I went into work, but I left early and boom, I had my short story box waiting for me. Yeah, or I might have to wait for the weekend, sad. <laughs> Uh, I also have an Amazon Prime wardrobe that's been ordered. I don't think it's been sent yet. Those tend to take a while. Hmm. But anyway, if you enjoy watching those kind of videos, please consider subscribing and I'll see you next time. Bye now.